Hello YouTube, Tim here. I've got two bows, basically both U3 curves. However, each finish differently. This is very basic. This is really just the simplest, most basic kind of bow that I make. I like doing it. It's very attractive. Basic wood grain finish, pin knocks, which I've taken to do a, uh, let me see if I can show you. After I cut the knock, I don't make it as square as I used to. I'll then take a rat tail file, a round file, and sh 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 rock it back and forth to create a, almost a groove for the string to ride in. That'll also help to retain the string, so it'll tend to shed less. Not that it ever did, but still. One extra good feature, I think. And then here was the just the typical handle wrapping. Somebody asked me to demonstrate different handle wrappings. and. I will do that as soon as I get the chance. I'm coming uh, coming up with a little bit of time when I'm going to be able to do that. And I'll show you several different techniques for that I use to wrap handles. And I'm sure you guys can come up with a whole bunch more. And I'd love to see and hear them. Here's the other bow that I did. They asked for dark wood. So what I... Wow. That's... This one looks really incredibly nice. Basically, it was a base coat of brown followed by black followed by red spray paint. Another layer or two of, of uh, the shoe polish, then another layer of the spray paint, then you know alternating layers of clear coat, etc. So this is what came out of it. Just a nice, rich, even finish. I'm getting much better at creating a nice, even finish on it and leaving just enough light areas so you can see the reddish tint through. It looks really great, I think. And I did a pleather wrap on the handle here, lined the pleather with silver, and did a little silver leaf and vine design all the way up and down the first you know, quarter of the limbs. So, let me see if I can, you can just see in some light how it looks without the glare. Anyway, it's a rich, deep, lovely color, and I very much like it. These are two lovely bows, similar yet different, alike in dignity. Anyway, thanks for watching YouTube. I probably won't get a chance to shoot these bows for you because they've got to go as soon as they can. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys around.